as you know, the community weighed in yesterday on our sales tax, renewal of the half cent, and a new half cent tax. Um, there's a lot of people we can thank for that. A lot of people in this room that work very, very hard to get the message out and get this done. But I think we also ought to give a thank you to the most important people, and those were the people who voted in this election. Whether they voted for it, whether they voted against it, this is exactly, this is exactly what local government is about and local citizen participation is about. And if you think about this, um, we spent an intensive three weeks taking information to the public, listening to their questions on social media. Um, Scott Bird and Jeff Seymour did over 40 meetings with people out there educating. So, um, I also I brought a, a penny, um, because I, I think I did this at, at the very beginning of our um, our initiative to inform voters. But um, voters did vote yes, and they knew that one cent makes sense for one cent makes sense for our community. And um, voters spoke and said that yes, they want relief in their property taxes. Yes, they want more jobs and economic growth and they want to continue to have safe neighborhoods and a high quality of life. So thank you to the voter and as um, our city manager had indicated, however you voted, I appreciate you voting, period. Um, my husband and I went on a three day long weekend, uh, two weeks, almost two weekends ago, through Iowa and Missouri and parts of Kansas and just saw many, many towns our size and smaller that are just shriveling up to nothing, just dying. Um, their main streets, their outer areas, and it just, every time we, we both said, wow, we are so fortunate. Ottawa is just so different. And so it just reconfirmed it, you know, how important that vote was, and um, I think that our community confirmed that amongst themselves by the vote. And I, I guess I just wanted to thank all the people that helped work very heartily on that initiative and to thank the citizens who put up with us um, knocking on their doors and ringing their doorbells and, and calling their phones, you know, during the dinner hour. But um, we felt that it was important to get that education out there and that communication. So we were thankful for that opportunity to do that. And it was rewarding just to see that what hard work can do for a community and knowing what this will mean for the future as well. So. Um, thank you all for that. It really is an investment in our community. I think that's what people recognize when they voted that way. So I'm very, very proud of it. to be an Ottawan. Uh, we've, a lot of things been going on this recent year with the acquisition of the industrial park, or the last 12 months, I should say. A school board a bond issue success, and now this. And so I think it's, it speaks volumes of our community, and they're willing to invest in the community, and not just for today, but for the future. There'll be people paying for this that really may not see the full <coughs> benefit of it, but that doesn't stop them from voting yes and then seeing the benefit for the future generations. It's a very sacrificial vote, and I really appreciate everybody voting that direction.